How is technology transforming cities? Technology, of course, is transforming every aspect of human life. But in the city, we seem to find the friction and the excitement uh, of the of the confluence of analog networks and dig digital networks. We have many friendship networks, but we also have many online friendship networks and, and the city pulls them together. I think cities are also the place where individual life is becoming most transformed. It's in, in, a, in a Western democratic city, it is the city is the place where life is the freest. And I think we in associate information freedom and personal liberty uh, very closely uh, I think cities have become the kind of theatre in which that drama is played out. And why are cities an important site for anti-capitalist resistance? I don't just want to resist capitalism. I want to transform economies in the direction of post-capitalism. And I think cities are going to be an important unit of that transformation. Because a city allows you to take some control of what we call the state. We all live in nation states, but cities increasingly are able to draw to themselves powers, the power to control the network infrastructure, the power to um, not own the data as the city, but to allow the citizens to commonly own the data. Um, cities are kind of a unit that's about the right size, where if they fight back, a major monopolistic corporation is going to notice if you fight back, they don't notice. If a small town fights back, it's, it's a quaint and, and interesting story. If Barcelona or London says to Google, Facebook, Amazon and Apple, we want to change the terms of trade with you, they will notice.